Okay, guys, so today we are going to be opening some Garbage Pail Kids. Now, Garbage Pail Kids came out in 1985. I was 10 years old. They blew the socks off of every kid on the planet. They've been around for almost 40 years now. Over the first three years, they put out about 15 series. Then they were off the market for a while, like 10, 15 years. And then they came back and they've been putting them out ever since. When I was a kid, I was absolutely in love with these things, but I have not seen anything past about series nine, maybe 10. So I've got about 35 years worth to get caught up on. Today, we're gonna be looking at a series one, from 2014, I actually have nine jumbo packs here. Look at all these. There are 21 cards in each of these packs, and we are gonna be opening up every single one right here, right now. Now, when I open these up, I wanna take care of them, so I also have some card sleeves, and I have some top loaders, which is like a thick plastic sleeve that it goes in after it goes in the sleeves here, just to help protect them a little bit more to keep them from getting bent or messed up. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get down to this. I am dying to dig into some of these things. So the guy that I got these from, he sold me 10 packs of these, and one of them turned out to be a different series. So I went ahead and opened those up just because I could not wait. But other than that, this is the first pack of Garbage Pail Kids that I have opened in 30, 35 years. They used to come with gum. I don't know at what point they stopped putting gum in, but if you buy the older ones and they still have the gum in them, the gum has pretty much destroyed at least one of those cards in the pack. So here's the first stack from the first pack, and let's see what we got. <laughs> now, I have never seen any of these unless I've seen them in the past few days, just looking at them um, online in passing. This one is called Dandy Leon, making fun, obviously, of a dandelion. <laughs> <laughs> We've got Cthulhu, which Cthulhu is like a sea monster. I hope this is focusing in on these correctly. We got Pasty Trey. What the heck is that? It looks like he's a Twinkie and he's getting bit on one end and puking out the other. <laughs> like puking the Twinkie cream out. Then we got Airy Ariel. Now remember, these are garbage pail kids. These things are gross. Look at this. She's like a wind sock, but she's farting too. What in the world, man? We got Buck Puck, and he's a hockey player. The puck's going straight through him. Oh my gosh, I love this. Sammy Serpent. Look at that. Looks like there's five heads on there, a five-headed snake. Okay, we've got Transforming Norman. And this one looks a lot like one of the older ones. I can't remember what it's called, but yeah, that's, um, there was another one back in the day that kind of looked like that one. Okay, and then we've got a match here, Dan D. Lion, and that one is the match for Dandy Leon. Because each one of these has a match to it. Like this is 46A, and this is called Clown and Clyde. And I don't know what the name of his match is, but he would be 46B, and it's the exact same card. Okay, I think some of these are kind of blurry when I put them up to the screen here, so I'm going to try to sit back a little bit more. But look at this. We've got Adam Bomb, and he is... Adam Bomb is actually, like, the first Garbage Pail Kid that anybody ever saw, because he is on the packages. He's not number one. He's, like, number eight. Eight A and B from the very first series in 1985. But they make a lot of different versions of him. So there he is, like, he's bombing a hill in a, uh, what do you call that, like a bobsled. And then we've got Bailed Bart, and Bailed Bart is actually a take on another one from back in the day, and uh, I think his name was Pat Splat, and he was falling off a skateboard. All right, what the heck is this? Fleet-footed Frank right here. And then we've got Folded Felix. Oh, this is cool. Da Da Donna. Look at that. It's making fun of Jaws. That is really cool. That may be my favorite one I've come across so far. Okay. <laughs> this one is called Walter Eyes. What the heck? Then we got Curling Sterling. Okay, there's a Hurt Kurt, and that is a match for the other one that we just looked at. Ooh. 
And look at this. Okay, so another thing that they're doing in these packs that they didn't used to do in the original packs is that they are putting special cards in these packs. And this one right here, it says, usually there's a name right down here. And this one says, make up your own name. So you're supposed to make up your own name for that guy. And he's like skiing, but he's split in half by the ski pole. I have no idea what I would name that guy, but I'm not going to write on it anyways. Okay, and then we've got this that just came out of the pack. And it says, Garbage Pail Kids Winter Olympics 2014 Precision Peeing 8 of 10. And it's like a, uh, a medal, an Olympic medal. Okay, let's keep moving here. All right, we got another one here that you name yourself. And he is also numbered 12B, just like Cthulhu. And then we've got two more from this pack. We've got Scissor Hands, like Edward Scissor Hands. And then we've got another match here, Wayne and Moon, right there. Okay, so that was pack number one. Let's go ahead and get into number two here. And the first one we have is a double. We already got that in the other one, so we'll set it over there. Here's one I haven't seen yet. Scuba Godiva. <laughs> Here's another one, Hungry Jane, making fun of the Hunger Games. Then we got Watch Doug, a three-headed dog. All right, we got another Atom Bomb. You can never have too many Atom Bombs. Downhill Till. If you remember a minute ago, this was the one that they said we could name ourselves, so we have one with a blank namespace. And then we have <laughs> Speed Demona. And she's like a speed skater who looks like she's been in a billion wrecks. Look at that one again. That is too funny. I think I found my sweet spot here where it's actually going to show them pretty clear to you guys. All right, let's move on to the second part of this pack. 21 cards in each pack and an exclusive bonus. All right. So, all right, we have another Da Da Donna, Walter E. Eyes. We got that one in the first pack. Oh, here we go. Frigid Bridget. And she's got a black border around there. That's another thing that they're doing. There's so many uh, different parallels, they call them, when it's different colors around the edges, and, uh, and there will be like different designs around the edges, like different colors of splatter paint and things like that. Okay, here, I don't remember. I know we got two of the ones that you name yourself in the first pack. And, uh, and this one is another one like that, as well as this one. So now we have four of those. What the heck is this? Brock Poster. <laughs> I don't know who that's making fun of. It's pretty cool, though. I like it. And then we have Picky Pedro. All right, so that's it for the second pack. A lot of doubles in that one. Let's move on to pack number three. This is pretty dang fun opening these things. As I've been opening them in between each pack, I've been putting them in their little savers. Both a sleeve and a top loader for each one. And if you'll also notice, there's awesome stuff like puzzle pieces and comics on the back of each of these. I gotta remember not to put it up too close or else it doesn't focus correctly. So there's a lot more to these than just the stickers. Okay, let's keep on moving here. Pack number three, guys, 21 more. In fact, I think it's 22, because like I pointed out before, it says 21 sticker cards plus one exclusive card. And from now on, guys, if I get any doubles, I'm just gonna say double, and I'm gonna go ahead and set it aside. Um, that way I'm not showing you the same thing over and over and over. So here's a double of Walter E. Eyes, Curling Sterling, Hurt Kurt, Dandy Leone, Cthulhu, Airy Ariel, Pasty Tray, Downhill Till. That's that one, and I believe that one is a double as well. Yeah, it is. Um, Speed Demona. Here we go. See no even. <laughs> Look at this one. What the heck, man? <laughs> Three heads, and he's doing the hear no evil, see no evil, speak no evil thing. That is too dang funny. All right, that's one we haven't got yet. Here we got another one, Lara Crackers. Okay. All right, all right, here's another one, Ira Booger. And that is the uh, the double for, what's this guy, Walter E. Eyes. Oh my gosh, then we got Jumpin' Jay. 
Remember the Gangnam Style song? So that's making fun of him, and he's farting. There's a lot of farting and puking going on with Garbage Pail Kids. All right, we got Drew Slowly. <laughs> he was in the, uh, the Western Gunfight, and he drew slowly. Let's see, we got Fleet Footed Frank. We've already seen that one. Um, Folded Felix, yeah, that's a double. Da Da Donna, that's a double. Here we got another one that we can come up with our own name. I'm putting all of those in their own specific pile as well. And we have another one. There must be two of these in each of these packs, because that's how it's been coming out so far. Oh, how cool is this? Moth Manny. Look at that. The Mothman of, I think, West Virginia or something like that. We got another black border, and it's called Connor Constellation. It's a constellation of a Garbage Pail Kid picking his nose. <laughs> and then we have a 63A for Wrinkly Randy, and he is uh, the double for Curling Sterling. All right, here we go. Pack four. Okay. <laughs> Cindy Smella. She's got one big smelly foot. We got Connor Constellation. That's the one that we just got in the other pack, and it had the black border. Look, Freddy the 13th. Oh my gosh. He's under a ladder. He has a black cat walking by, a broken mirror, salt pouring on him, and an umbrella open. That's hilarious. All right. Gladys Slipper. So already we've got um, a double there, a 6A and 6B. All right. Picked Parker. So that's the double for Connor, Connor Stellation. Bad Luck Chuck. That's the match for Freddy the 13th. Gangnam Kyle. In the last pack, we got the other one, uh, Jumpin' J. So, oh my gosh, look at this one. Fishy Flora. What the heck? That is too funny. Oh, look, it's a Garbage Pail Kid's head on the front of the fish right there. <laughs> Okay, we got Job Globe. I know it might be corny because, like, everybody loves Garbage Pail Kids because they're gross and they're farting and snotting and throwing up and everything. But I love the corny stuff like this, where they're not even doing anything gross. It's just funny. It's just the world on his back. That is too funny. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Look at this. Rattled Ruth. <laughs> That is hilarious. And then we have, what the heck, Jenny Fish Sandwich. I guess that's supposed to be making fun of, like, peanut butter and jelly sandwich, because there's peanut butter in the background. Jenny Fish Sandwich. What the heck, man? All right, let's get into the second half of this pack. Let's see. Okay, we got Scorched Scott. He's on a bug light, like a bug zapper. Served Sawyer. Oh my gosh, he's got his head on the on the plate. Poisoned Perry. He's a scorpion. Dull Dorothy. Okay. Boxed Bill. What do you call that guy? He's like a mime. He's a mime who has locked himself in the box. A non-existent box. We got Bert House. <laughs> Look at this. It's the face is on the birdhouse, and he's, like, choking on the bird as it enters. Um, okay, and then here's our two that we can name ourselves. It's the Dandelion one and, uh, the Freddy the 13th. And then we've got, uh, Moth Manny. And is that a double, or is that... Yeah, that one's a double. Wow, that's, that's the first double that we've got out of this entire pack. Oh my gosh, look at this one, guys. T-Rex. That is hilarious. He's, like, <laughs> he's wearing a baseball cap and he's like barely throwing the ball because he has the tiny little T-Rex arms. That is too funny. Oh, and it's a black border. That's pretty cool. Okay, and then we have Luge Luz. And the Luge is one of those Olympic sports where they're like going down a big slide. That is pretty cool, guys. The only thing we got doubles for in that entire pack was this one right here. All right, I'm having too much fun with these guys. Let's get into pack number five here. Double pack number five. Okay, here we go. Yes, Sword in the Stone. 
I love getting these ones that I haven't seen before. Okay. <laughs> Autopus. It's a diver with an octopus stuck on his face. That is too funny. Okay, Cat Miss. And that is the match to Hungry Jane over there. Oh, and Autopus is the match to Scuba Godiva. Then we got Jake Charmer. He's a snake charmer, but he's like charming the skin off his head. Okay. We got <laughs> Lonely. It's a astronaut in a trash can spaceship. What the heck? Or it's not a not a spaceship, but like a satellite. Okay, then we got Chi Guevara. I don't know if that's how you say it, but that is the match to Picky Pedro. And then, okay, here's our two that we get to name. That one there, the mime in a box. And, oh my gosh, this is one of my favorites. That is too hilarious. I just love that birdhouse face with the bird stuck in his mouth. That is too dang funny. Okay, we got one double here. We got another dull Dorothy, but this one has the black border, so that's pretty cool. And then we've got Temple Run, if you remember the Temple Run. Okay, now we got the whole second half of this one to go. And so far, we only have one double, Brock Poster. Okay, we got Cerber Gus, the three-headed dog. That is the match for Watch Doug. And then we have <laughs> Bad Pitch Mitch, which is the match for T-Rex. That just cracks me up. Look at that. Those tiny little arms, and he can barely throw the baseball. Ooh, look at this one. We got Complex Connie. Oh my gosh. Several other little garbage pail kids coming out her eyes and her nose and her mouth. All right, Complex Connie. Then we got Smashing Smith and Bogey Manuel. Okay, some kind of an alien or something. Look, he's got a face on his stomach, too. That's pretty weird. Um, okay, we got a match. Excalibur, and that's a match for Sword in a Stone. Royal Flush Russ. <laughs> it's like a guard at the palace. Three Wise Monty, and that's the match for See No Even. Ooh, look at this, guys. We got a a signature sketch card. Check that out. I'm in these garbage pail groups, and I keep seeing people posting that they got these sketch cards. That is really, really cool. I'll show you the back there, too. It says, congratulations, sketch card. You now own a one-of-a-kind piece of art, hand-drawn by one of the garbage pail kids' artists. That is pretty cool. Um, and it, what's really cool about that is that it has sat in one of these sealed packs since 2014. So nine years, guys, that has sat in a pack. Oh my gosh, look at this one. <laughs> it's called Taste Bud. Oh my gosh, I love Garbage Pail Kids so much. And then we have another match here. We got Hydra, and that is the match for, where did I put it? Sammy Serpent here. So, all right, we are doing pretty dang good, guys. And I'm really, really excited about that signed sketch card. That is really cool. All right, let's keep on moving, guys. This is way too much fun. And I have tons more Garbage Pail Kids in the other room to open up. We're not going to do them today, but, uh, but I will have more videos coming because I just absolutely love these things. All right, pack number six. All right, there's a double, we got a double, we got a double, 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 and another double. Although one of them was Atom Bomb, so that's still cool. All right, second half of pack six. All right, we got the match, Stuffed Steph, and that's the match to Burt House. Then here's one I haven't seen, Relaxed Jacks. What the heck? It's a kid playing a video game on a garbage pail kid who is like a uh, a bean bag. <laughs> All right, we got decapitate, and his head is getting cut off by the uh, by the elevator door. We got braided Brittany, and she's jumping rope with her own braided hair. All right, origami Tommy, and that one is a match for. Folded Felix. All right, here we go. We got John Julie, and that is a match for 
Da Da Donna. We have another Winter Olympics speed swearing medal. <laughs> That's Mac Quack on there. That is a Garbage Pail Kid from, man, second or third series, maybe even fourth. I don't remember, but that's a pretty cool one right there. All right, and now we're into the ones that we can name ourselves, and there's the clown. And if you look at his eyes, it's actually a balloon animal that he's making with his eye. What the heck? How crazy is that? Oh, here's one I haven't seen, and it's another one that we get to name. So that's a new one to me. Here's... Sweater Eaten. <laughs> and that is the match for um, Moth Manny. Okay. And then we have another match here. Satellite Dwight. And that is the match for... Where did he go? Lonely. So, all right. We didn't do too bad with that pack. And half of them were doubles. But that's okay. We got some pretty good ones. And we got the medal. All right. Let's keep on moving. Pack number seven. Whip. We got two more packs after this. All right, here we go. That's a double. That's a double. That's a double. Double. Look at this one. This is one that we get to name ourselves. I don't know what the real name is, but we get to name that one ourselves. And then here is uh, Waltery Eyes. We get to name that one ourselves as well. And there's a double. Then we have a Patty Putty. She is actually from the second series back in 1985. She's got a black border on there, so we're going to put that one in a different pile. And then, I, this is a double, but I just got to show you again because I love it so much. Rattled Ruth. I think that is absolutely hilarious. <laughs> All right, let's keep on moving here. We got another double. Here we go. We got a Show Don, and he is a match for Drew Slowly. And then we got Runny Ricky, and he's a match for Fleetwooded Frank. Oh my gosh, look at this one. Fishbowl Phil. I haven't seen that one yet. He His body is a fishbowl, and he's feeding the fish by pouring the fish food in his mouth. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is making fun of Adventure Time. Adventure Tim. Look at that. That is totally awesome. I love Adventure Time. Then we got Tic Tac Joe. We have a match, Feeding Fritz, and that is a match for Fishbowl Phil. Oh my gosh. Mustache Max. <laughs> he's a, he's got a plethora of mustaches on him. And then here we go, Boney Joni. Now, Boney Joni, I think, is originally from the first series, maybe second, but I'm pretty sure it's the first. And here she is doing uh, Olympic sledding. That is too dang funny. And then we have Walking Ted, and he's walking on the treadmill. Okay, so that's it for pack number seven. Let's go ahead and bust into pack number eight. Okay, here we go. That one's a double, Buck Puck. Sammy Serpent, that's a double, that's a double, that's a double, that's a double. Sneaky Samir, that's a match for Jake Charmer. Okay, and then here's one that we name ourselves. Synchronized Sneezing. <laughs> Okay, and then we have another one here that we name ourselves, and that was the Sword and the Stone one. Here we go. Cut Upton. And that one, um, I know we have the match out here somewhere. Oh, maybe we don't. Maybe, maybe when we pulled him the first time, he had a black border. I think that's what it was. So, okay, Cut Upton. Oh my gosh, I didn't even notice this. Look, he's cutting, and he cut the Garbage Pail Kids sign over top of him. That is too funny. I love that. Okay, and then we got another another layer of crackers there. So that's another double. Let's keep moving here. We got Skiing Ian. That one's a match for Downhill Till. Barry Barber. That's a match for Mustache Max. Magnetic Mick. I haven't seen that one except for he was one of them that we get to name ourselves. Here we go. Anglin Andy. There we go. He's a match for Fishy Flora. SPL Atlas or Splat... Oh, Splatless. Okay. <laughs> I got it. Sometimes you gotta figure it out with these names. We got Wendy Chimes. <laughs> and that one is the match for uh, Rattled Ruth. That is so funny. I just love those three teeth on that face. That is too funny. 
Monroe in the closet, and that's the match for Boogeyman. Tired Tyler. We got Nordic Nessie. Now, I thought we had the match here, but we don't because the other one, um, it has the black border. So it is, but it isn't. And then we have Biter Byron there. And that one is the match for Walking Ted. Okay, guys, we are down to our very last pack. Number nine. I can't wait to dig into these things and see what else we get here. So far, this is our stack of doubles. So that's really not too bad. Okay, we got Rotten Art. That's one that we just got a minute ago to name ourselves, and I wasn't sure what he was called. I don't think we have him yet. We have <laughs> Stalked Jack, and he has a beanstalk growing through him. We have Ringo Pop. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He's like a big ogre. Skelly Tanya, which is the match for Boney Joni. Um, let's see, we have Patty Putty. So now we actually have the match. We got Eyed Ivan. So we finally have the match for Clown and Clyde. Still Leaf. I think that's what that says. So that's a match for uh, Rotten Art. Then we have Ben Stock. That's a match for Stocked Jack. There's a double. We got another Adam Bomb and another Bale Bart. All right. We have about 10 more cards, guys. Maybe it's even 11. I'm not sure. But here we go. But what the heck? Death Bath Timon. <laughs> that one is a match. Cthulhu. Okay. Vanilla Cream. And that one is a match for Pasty Tray. Then we got Wanda Sock. And that is a match for Airy Ariel. Oh my gosh, Fecal Francis. And that one is a match for Temple Ron. We got Dizzy Dave, who I am pretty sure he's also from one of the earlier uh, series. Sore Sophie, who is a match for Taste Bud. Here's one of them we get to name ourselves. And the other one we get to name ourselves. I love that guy. We got a double... A double and a double. All right, let me look at these guys and I will show you what we got all together. Okay, so I've got them all organized here. That was so much fun, guys. I have so many more to open and I hope you'll stick around. I'm gonna try to do this at least once a week, but let me show you what we got here. Okay, so this is the stack of doubles. Not too bad. We did get a good handful of them, but really it's not too bad when you compare them with the stack of all the matches that we got. That is pretty dang good. I didn't count how many matches there are, but we did get a gigantic stack of them. So this is the stack of cards that we got that don't have matches, or that we didn't find in the packs at least. This is the stack of the cards that we got where we were given the option to do our own name, like to write in our own name under there, make up a name for these guys. Then we have a small stack of the black border cards. One, two, three, four, five, six of those. Three medals. And then we have probably, if you're looking at these as far as value goes, probably the most valuable one in the entire thing is the signed sketch card here. Pretty dang cool. I'm going to have to look up that name on there. I honestly don't know a whole lot about the guys who draw these things right now. But I'm going to learn because this is totally fun and I can't wait to rip open some more. If you like this video, make sure that you give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment below. And like I said, I'm going to try to do a video like this once a week. Otherwise, it's back to the normal Saturday night snack and a movie in Spirit Halloween.